guys, it's early November. I'm down in Wellington, Texas with Joe O'Rear of Roll Outfitters. He's owner operator and he's guiding me and running the camera today. We're watching this huge CRP with Shinnery Oak and a huge bedding area just to our west side. Where there's a lot of surrounding crop fields, this is an evening hunt. What we're hoping they're gonna do is get up out of bedding area and work our way to the crop fields in front of us. Set back. The rut's coming, may kick off today. It was 85 yesterday, the high today is about 50. We're looking for good things to happen. Sit back and enjoy. Go ahead and pan out while I can come on. <laughs> Joke! Oh, God! God. <laughs> Jesus! Freaking drop time! Oh, oh man, man, drop time! God, talk. Oh, man. Joe O'Reilly, you are a man, brother. <laughs> Folks, I hadn't, I hadn't had time to do a morning interview because. We got here, we're in the same stand we was at yesterday evening. It's the perfect, perfect setup. The deer bed to our west and in, in their fields to the east, crop fields, and we're watching this huge CRP. Perfect, perfect transition, hiding area, everything you want for big bucks. We've got four, five, eight pointers on us already this morning. I couldn't even do an interview with so covered up the deer. This beautiful. Beautiful buck come in running six, eight does. And we watch him and we watch him and he's he's running does and he's he's not standing still and gives us a good shot. He finally stops, he gives us a good shot, good two hundred yard shot, I squeeze the trigger, the gun snaps. <laughs> Only me. 
and there was a shell in the chamber too. Yeah, I, I had it, the, I don't know if it was the shell, the gun, or what. So I had to pull the, I had to reload my gun and shot and hit him, and uh, I hit him good. I know what I could see where oh, the yeah, blood that, was coming out of him, and then shot. we uh, we had an anchored him out there. Folks, I can't believe this. God, what a button. Joe O'Reilly. Joe O'Reilly. Write it down. Roll oh, yeah. outfitters. Oh, real. Oh, real. Oh, real. He's one. He's Irish. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, we're going to give it a minute. Call me O'Reilly if you want to. Folks, I'm shaking so bad. I'm going to have to calm down for a minute. We're going to go out and check this beast out. Don't go anywhere. Oh, I hear man. you, brother. Yeah, yeah. Rip, rip. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Look at that thing. Oh. Come here, son. Golly. <laughs> God. God, look at that buck. Son. Yeah, yeah. That is awesome. Folks, I don't know what to say. I've never seen it. I've never seen a deer like this on the hoof in my life. Look at that. God. Look. Count him up there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Thirteen. Thirteen. <laughs> broke off, broke off. It was a 15-pointer one time. You are the man. He's got it all. Look at that, Joe. Yeah. Mass. Folks, this deer, tine he's got mass, tine length. Drop time. Drop time. Split G2. Kick. Man. I can't be more proud. What a day this has been. Joe, you said he was in here. Yeah. He's got pictures of him on the trail camera. This was his home. This is what he called a splinter buck. Unbelievable. It's two years in a row for you, Joe. Yeah. Killed a big 11-pointer last year. Yeah. 13 they, this year. Yeah. yeah. You got a big muley last year. He oh, oh definitely my. had some good luck. Huh. Wow. If you want a truly trophy whitetail, get down here to Wellington, Texas. See Joe O'Rear, rolloutfitters.com. Unbelievable. I had to hunt a whole day last year before I killed my deer.
first mule deer. Yes. Yeah, baby. Did you have him? All right. All right. Check that out. That's what I'm talking about. My first mule deer. Dude, that's awesome. It's a great five by five. It's got good forks, good brown tines. Hey man, it's got a big old body on it. I want to thank Joe at Rolla Outfitters here in Wellington, Texas. Man, these guys have been so cool to be with. He's worked hard. He's put us on the deer. We've seen some stud whitetails, and uh, they spotted this muley the other day, actually. And uh, we came into town, and he told us about it. And I told him from the get-go, if I could uh, get on this one here, this is the one I wanted. 